everybody, welcome to a props edition of Daily Action Picks. I'm Joe Delera, and I've got one of my favorite props for today's slate and a little bit of a spin on a way to play it. So the guy in the game that I'm targeting is the Boston Celtics versus the Chicago Bulls. And the player in particular that I'm targeting is Jason Tatum. Look, this Bulls defense has not been good overall on the entire season. They're in 21st on the whole season, allowing 113.4 points per 100 possessions. However, over the past two weeks, we've seen that number actually get worse. They're allowing 118.8 points per 100 possessions. It's not great defensively. It's bottom of the league. And this is a spot that I think Boston's efficient offense is going to be able to capitalize on them. With that in mind, I'm looking at Jason Tatum. The Celtics have been great after the All-Star break, and a large part of that is because of Jason Tatum. Since the All-Star break, he's averaging 31.1 points per game on 50% shooting from the field and 41.3% shooting from downtown. Those are significant upticks. That's about a six-point jump from his pre-All-Star average, and his three-point percentage has raised nearly 10 points. So that's an angle that I want to target, especially against this Bulls defense that although they limit three-point attempts, they allow opponents to shoot 36.9% from three-point range, which is bottom five in the league. So I like this spot for Tatum. His point, his three points prop is set at over two and a half. And there's some juice on it. It's around minus 140 right now, but I still like the spot. He's gone over in 51% of their games on the season. But if we look at this, he's gone over in 66% of their wins. So that's a, the twist that I want to put on this prop. I think that these two things are heavily correlated. And I like the Celtics overall in this game anyway. Look, over the past two weeks, the Bulls, and we've seen them slip. They're sliding. They're losing to a lot of teams that they really probably shouldn't even lose to. But over the past two weeks, Chicago has a minus 6.4 point differential. They're three and four. They haven't been particularly good. And in the meantime, Boston is crushing it. They're four and two. They have a plus 15.7 point differential over the last two weeks. They're top four in both offense and defense. So we're already seeing the spread at minus seven. It's moved to minus seven and a half in some books. I think that this is a spot where Boston should definitely win. So with that in mind, I think you can combine the two into a same game parlay. The Celtics to win and Jason Tatum to go over two and a half threes, and you can get about plus 120, depending on the book that you use. So that's my best bet and a different twist on it for today. And let me know if you're riding, let me know if you're following. Hit me up in the comments, hit me up in the Action app and on Twitter, at Joe Delera, and tune in every day for more free daily action picks.